guys, this is Tara with Kitten Sweets and Tarot, and today is day six of Ethany's hashtag 31 Days of Tarot 2021. And today's prompt asks us what the deck was that we crossed off our wish list in 2020. And okay, so the deck that I'm gonna show you, I don't I don't believe I ordered it in 2020, I ordered it in 2019 but it was a pre-order. Um, and so it finally showed up in 2020. So technically I did cross it off my wish list, but I was waiting for it for a really long time. And it's one that, um, you know, I had my eye on and I was just like sitting in anticipation as the months rolled by. Um, but I'm so happy that I have it now. And it is uh, Kelly Burton's Journey of the Sacred Bee. Um, and so it's, uh, it's just beautiful. I mean, Ah, check out the box. <laughs> um, but anyway, I I think I already did a review of it. If I haven't, I need to totally do a review of it. But it's got so much information in this little white book. Um, so there's a lot of good stuff here. Um, yeah. And then let me just take you on a journey of the cards really quick. So here's the backing. You got these beautiful, like, it's like a seafoam greenish blue foil bees and then uh, just okay so beyond the aesthetics of that looking at the artwork on the cards the collage work and um the interpretation you know that the creator had for each of these cards was just amazing and i love bees i mean um there is a bracelet that I don't take off. It's a little bee here. Uh, and even my watch is <laughs> yellow and black. Um, but yeah, so I have a thing for bees and they're really good. They help my roses, you know, <laughs> I love a little garden. Um, but yeah, I was so happy to finally have received this in 2020. I work with it quite a bit. Um, so I, I will try to link her, um, her website down below, you know, in case you are interested. I don't like, I don't know if there's more or what edition she's on or if she's still on the first edition or like what's going on. <laughs> um, but I'm just happy that I get to use it and have so much fun with it now. But yeah, so Journey of the Sacred Bee was the deck that I uh, crossed off my wish list in 2020, technically. <laughs> so anyway, that's it. Uh, I guess I will catch you guys tomorrow for day seven. Um, but yeah, I've enjoyed doing these. I've enjoyed doing these since Ethany first started doing these. So thank you to Ethany. And yeah, I guess I'll catch you guys tomorrow. If you dug this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to click subscribe and don't forget to click that ding, ding, ding notification bell for more videos just like this. Uh, and if you want to catch a reading for me, click down below www.kittensweightsandtarot.com. Everything is in the information box. If you want to catch a reading for me, check out all the goodies I make like my bracelets. <laughs> um, and also there is a link to my Leon Mystery School in case you are wondering uh, how to expand your spiritual knowledge. And, and uh, there's also a link to my Patreon. So if you are wondering how to become a patron and help me do more and create more for you spiritual homies, all those links are down below uh, as well as like my newsletter and stuff like that. So anyway, I will catch you spiritual homies later. Peace, love, and chicken grease. Peace out.